Just got to grab my vape. I was just getting the van ready there. Seven peas. Proper planning and preparation prevents piss poor performance. So I've just done all, I've just changed all my water. That's me get about 55 litres of water, which is plenty. There's always, uh, there's always some place I can get water. Checked all my tyres, checked all my levels, my oil, my, all my fluids. It's all ship shape. Everything's ready to go. Uh, great, great thing this. This is a, di a digital air compressor. My tyres were sitting at 45, it should have been at 47. So uh, all my tyres are done. Just plugs into your 12 volt or as old jeans, your fag lighter. Plugs into there. And here's a here's a great thing for anybody out and about a jump starter. Remember you used to have uh, jump start cables and you had to stop somebody and say, any chance you give me a jump start mate? And use his battery to connect to your battery. And then he would rev up his engine, get his battery. And then he made, well this wee thing does the exact same as his battery. It acts like uh, another battery. And it's a great, it's a great thing. It's not very big. It's not very dear either. See, it comes in a wee, wee container. And that's all the size it is. That's, that's just as big as my horn. You've got the cables. Here's the cables that connect it. You're pausing your neg. And I have used this, not on my own vehicle, I might say. I was parked up. Uh, through in Inverclyde and out the car park out in Morris Lassie come up to me I don't know why she picked me maybe because I was sitting there having a cup of tea she probably was out this guy's got everything she went have you got jump jump leads I said I've got better than that I've got a, I've got a starter mum will try it because I hadn't tried it and it worked perfectly so I'm going to make sure that that's charged up and the, the Lassie was there the moon she's like where did you get that for I told her there's all the wee lights on, it's fully charged. You can see all the lights on, it's fully charged. For the last time I charged it up, so I don't need to charge it. She was there, the moon mate, she went, where did you get that for? I said, I think I got it off Amazon or something. And uh, she went, I'm going to get one of them. I don't know if she ever did. It's a wee torch on it or not. SOS. So, I got, I got her motor started. And she was nearly, she nearly burst out greeting. And I said to her, she tried to give me money. Is that, is that what we, the society we've came to? She tried to give me money to say thanks and that. And I, I thought to myself, I don't want, I don't want your money. If, if you, if you can't help some do it, it's, it's really a bad day. I said, I don't, I don't want your money, you're all right, thanks very much. I said, put it towards your your starter when you buy it. So anybody's uh, out and about, even for your own motor, it's ideal. It's a model BLK JQL. Believe it or not, it's China, Chinese. But uh, ideal, there it's there jump starter so even for your own motor boat anything let's go on here a boat a tent it'll run power in a tent and your uh, your motor and Susan got me a wee tag the wayne has been playing with the keys you'll see the last video the wayne has been playing with the keys because he he can put them in the ignition now and put all the lights on the window the window wiper so he's been wanting to play with these in the house so Susan bought wee tags, a uh, teeny one of them bought these wee tags, and uh, it's got a remote control. You just press it, and this this bleeps and uh, flashes, lets you know where it is. So if he loses the keys in the house, I can find them. So there was four of them, and uh, it's it's ideal. 
So that's it, so I'm, I'm heading maybe down south. Susan bought me a new towel, so I've got to take my towels in. New towel. <laughs> it's massive. <laughs> so thanks very much for that towel, Susan. She saw it and it was only four quid and she went, oh, I'm going to buy that. That'll do Charlie for the van set because I've got two towels in here. And I'll just swap them in now. Keep this one. Put it in with the rest of my kit. Here's my two towels, which I'll take in now and get washed. They've already been washed, but... I'll take this one. And uh, I've got the big Adidas towel that she bought me. She's always looking out for things for the van. She's thinking that'll do. I'll do Charlie in the van. Right, just come up there. There we go. Okay, they meant to get washed. So anyway, so that's me. I'm getting ready to rock and roll. I'm going to I'm going to head down south. I'm going to head down to the borders. Coldstream, Berry upon Tweed, down that area. Uh, Shuggy's talked me into it. He goes there camping. I'm an alien. They go away down that area and it's, it's, it's beautiful. Uh, there's lots of places to go and visit. So I had a wee look at the map and I thought, ah, it looks quite nice there. So rather than head up, I'm going to head down. And I might end up at uh, Port Carlisle, down at Roberts Cairn, which is out in the estuary. Obviously, I've got to wait till the tide goes out. I'll go down that and I might re rejig it. That's been there for years. So I might rejig it. So anyway, there's the wee things I wanted to show you. The wee tag for the, the keys, the jump starter and the digital air compressor. Ideal for out and about. So anyway, Susan's phone, she's bringing in a pizza. I'm going to end up talking Italian. And uh, there's the... Uh, there's the torch that I got. I can get it back out here. I got these done at the uh, Glasgow auctions. It's, it's ideal. It's an ideal torch. I'm never ready. And it's an LED. So. See what like that is, I'll test that out at night, down at the borders. I'm going to put it somewhere else where I can get it after you bother. Put it there. Just tighten it. There we go. So anyway, so that's me as you can see, in the Alfie. He's about to town centre. Smell the flowers, blow out the candles. So Charlie out and about, the seven P's, as I said, proper planning and preparation prevents piss poor performance. So here we go, catch us all soon. How you doing folk? Charlie out and about. Right, I'm up at Loch Dune. How beautiful is that? Tuesday and yesterday uh, when I got the van already with thunderstorms thunder and lightning and it never stopped raining and it was raining on the way up here this is East Ayrshire I don't know if you want to see all the images there's a wee guy down there fishing see him down there the midges are it. So I've stopped here on my travels. I'm heading to Loch Ken, as in Barbie. Ken and Barbie. So I'm heading to, oh, I see there's a couple of tents now there. They're bringing the eight with the midges. A wee caravan site up there. I just thought I'd pull in. 
was only two and a half miles off my original journey. So I thought I'd come down and see Loch Doon. Even the sheep's coming out to see me. There they go. That's beautiful. That's another lock half my half my list. There's a wee dam. Big sign there, danger of death. Keep clear. Deep water. There we go, beautiful isn't it? I've only got 3G here. So I'm going to I'll head on to my original plan, which is Loch Ken. You can speak to you all soon. Charlie, out and about. How you doing, folk? Charlie's still out and about. That's a river doing. Under the bridge, yeah. And that's how uh, I went out that bit to get to Lockdown. Uh, the midges were eating me alive. Felt sorry for the people in their tents. I've came here, there's a nice wee part in the area here. Just a pity about the mud. People driving there, all the grass bits. Wee picnic tables, a couple of bins. There's no signs, so you could park here overnight. I'm going to go to uh, Loch Ken. Ken and Barbie. You can. That's what I'm heading for. There's a nice wee bit here. And you've got 4G. Good signal. Under a beautiful big tree. I'm going to move on anyway. Susan's just checked in. She's got that Life 360. She said, yeah, I see you're stopped. So anyway, up at Dalmellington, so I'll head new to, so I'll head new to Buck Ken, I'll get set up there, under a beautiful big tree here. I'll speak to his old soon, Charlie. Out and about. See his old soon. How you doing, folk? Charlie, out and about. Down at a lock. Lock down. I found a cracking wee spot. I drove by it. If you blink, you'd have missed it. A wee parking area. So I'm going to park in here. As I've been anyway, we turning back, right in amongst the trees, and I've got 4G. And there's a bin. I can sit and chill out. Right in, the, right in among the woods. Here we go. So, nice wee parking area. Didn't it a lock? Just as behind me there. Just got a phone call there saying that my phone was going to be deactivated today. English, Chinese, French, whatever, whatever language you needed. I don't know what that was all about. Anyway, I'm going to go get set up, get parked in there, speak to you all soon. Charlie, still out and about. How you doing, folk? Charlie, still out and about. Just going to sell a cup of coffee. There's one of the big coffee bags that Stacey Ann got me. This one is uh, the Smart Cookie. And it's a, uh, let's see, six out of ten. So we'll see how it goes. I've had to go to plan B because I couldn't 
can you get a signal my telly but not to worry I brought my PlayStation maybe and I've got a, a, a box set called Battleground Vietnam War in the Jungle got it out at a charity shop I've been wanting to watch it for quite a while and I had it in the house, so I thought I'll take that with me whilst I'm out and about. And you should have thought that sugar up. Not to worry. Enough to do me. That's a wee air fan in the, the jacket you're running. Because obviously I'm running my telly on my PlayStation and my wee lights. So, we'll see what kind of coffee we get out of this one. So, I hope you're all doing well. So, see, I can get two cups out of that, so I've got, so I've got that extra cup out. But, Put my coffee bag in it once it's once it's settled. So I'm at lock lock down. Now I'm not far from Castle Douglas, so I'm going to head to Castle Douglas tomorrow. Here's my kettle boiling. And I only put enough water in the kettle to fill my cup. No point in overfilling the kettle. As you can see, I'm going to let that brew for a couple of minutes. Times it. Guys, Paul, I've got a G Shock on, quarter past six. Give that a couple of minutes, I can smell it already. Strong, it's dead clammy in it and all. As if it's dead clammy. So I was saying, I'm not far from Castle Douglas. So I'm going to go and visit her tomorrow. I'm sure that's the Black Douglas. That's his castle. Dumfries and Galloway, that's where I am at the moment. I'm in Dumfries and Galloway. So there we go, Charlie out and about. Having a cup of coffee. I'll get some. We'll get something to eat later on. Can get a wee bit. So you all take care. Whatever you're doing, do it right, do it well, do it good. And don't hurt, hurt anybody doing it, because that means you're doing it wrong. So anyway, I'm going to get back into this. Battleground Vietnam, War in the Jungle. That kind of thing. You all take care. Charlie, out and about. Now what time is it now? Five past nine. See the wee guy walking past, walking down here. His backpack and all that one. His wee dog. I know he didn't get through that, but. And that road all quiet and then. There's a sign, fishing, fishing private permits available at the Mosteel Post Office.
Let me see. The sheep suit. Red sky at night. Should somebody will follow that in? Is it Shepherd's Delight? And I'm watching that box set of uh, uh, Vietnam. I find it. Very interesting. So I'll go back into my ducat. That was Nam. There we go. Charlie, out and about. It's quite a good torch. I go. I don't know if you'll be able to see them. There's loads of bats. I'll try and get on one of them. Loads of bats flying about. That was quite a low one there. Oh, that one there. Well, there you go, there's bats everywhere. And there's an owl. Night night.